Hello everyone, welcome to Thoughts on Education by College Dunya. Today we have Dr. Subhas K. Sinde, Vice Principal of Rukmani Kira College of Engineering, Navi Mumbai. Hello sir, welcome to Thoughts on Education. Can you have an introduction please? Thank you. Uh, I am Dr. Subhash Krishwarao Shinde, working as a Vice Principal of Maya Tila College of Engineering. First of all, I welcome uh, the college junior uh, uh, in this platform and they are taking the good initiative uh, to give the opportunity to the, all the academicians to give the, their the thought process and uh, talk about the, how the academic is supposed to be happen in the institute or into the futures. So it's a great work. Uh, so once again, I thanks on behalf of my Tila College of Engineering. Thank you, sir, for your introduction. So the first question is, being the Vice Principal of Lokman Tila College of Engineering, what is your leadership philosophy and how you describe your role? Yeah, uh, when I'm describing as a leader, see, see in the academician and uh, in the other uh, organization, there is a difference. When you talk about the institute, we call as uh, academic organizations. So I think my vision is, uh, it's more about the student centric. So here the approach uh, is a vision that I look it forward into that. So all the stakeholders, so the parents, the teachers, the employee, all the employees as well as the employees. So they look how the overall development of the students and how the faculty as well as the student, they reach to their the target. So that's my vision. Next question is, being the Vice Principal of Lokman Tilak of College of Engineering, how do you de develop the plans for marketing and administration of your college? Yeah. So we'll talk about the marketing as you are already aware into that one. This is the world of the digital. In this digital era, uh, so the, everyone is available into the online fashions. Everyone wants all the information in the single click. So uh, we have our own uh, website that is www.ltc.com. That uh, website is uh, very much uh, user friendly, more informative. And uh, what are the current events are, are happening? All the events, video, everything we are uploaded onto that one. As well as we have our own blogs, web blogs. As well as uh, we arrange the good workshops for the students as well as for the researchers. Also, uh, we uh, call the alumni for the interaction purposes. And uh, through the social media also, we can do some sort of the advertisements. Next question is, what would you like people to know about your college that may not know? Yeah, uh, it's a very good question uh, because uh, sometimes uh, the uh, half information presents with uh, many people. But uh, that's half information uh, having some sort of the noise. So the many people not aware into that one. So in our college, the maximum are the full-time faculty. And the faculty is uh, well qualified, near about the 15 years, the retention ratio in our college. Also, our college is the first engineering college who started the PhD program in Mumbai University. So uh, that is the unique uh, features. Also, our college is accredited by NAC in the cycle one as well as in the cycle two with the A grade. Uh, one of the beauty into that one, in our college, we have the Central of Excellence uh, that is sponsored by the Code Unnati, uh, run by the SAP. So this is the Code Unnati uh, Central of Excellence, which uh, takes the, some courses for the value additions. And because of this value addition courses, the learner are uh, very much uh, confident about their the subject and they are ready to uh, as the industry requirement. Also, we have the very good infrastructures, good labs, good classrooms, playing grounds, as well as the many activities we can do for the overall development of the students. Next question is, what do you see as Lokman Club College of Engineering data strength? See, uh, our college is, is the first college when you talk about the Mumbai University. We started the, all the emerging trends. For example, computer science and engineering in AIML, computer science engineering in the data science, computer science engineering, IoT, as well as the blockchain and cyber security. These are the current trends which require for the industry. And whenever the ICT, given the, that's the, these are the new trends supposed to be uh, open in your the institute. So I think in the Mumbai University, the LTC is the first engineering college which has opened these, all these the three programs. 
and uh, because of that uh, we are into the uh, in hand in hand with the industry what is the industry requirement according that we change so that's the main beauty of our the institute next question is when you first come to the college what was your vision for this college has it evolved and how far along in implementing that vision are you yeah so when i came to the college my uh, vision into that one uh, the my college should be in the due, co- uh, due course of time uh, it should be the uh, autonomy that we call as academy autonomy to require for that the academy autonomy some steps are supposed to be required so the very first uh, the accreditation so that already we done that is the nac accreditation with the a grade also we are doing the mba and we have submitted we received the permanent affiliations now uh, we are urgent uh, to submit the application form for the academic uh, autonomy so what is the advantage we get is the academic autonomy so we can uh, build up our own curriculum as per the industry requirement so we are having the flexibility and the, the latest the, that is the new education policy we can really implement uh, in the uh, autonomy so that flexibility we get it and because of that we are uh, very much eager to start this the academic autonomy and maybe in due course of maybe in the next year we will be definitely will come to this one we can start the academic autonomy so we we'll get academic autonomy next question is can you discuss any ongoing collaboration or partnership with other education institution or companies that benefit lokman tilak college of engineering yeah we already did the many uh, collaboration just i give you an example we have started the center of excellence so that's collaboration with the edunet foundation so the edunet foundation is the partner of the sap as well as is the partner of the ibm so uh, also we are a partner with the many like as a cisco also we are a partner with the uh, that is the linux where we can run some sort of the uh, courses that is the linux operating system the system software uh the also in the mechanical uh, very much into that one we have the ishre ashre so these are the chapters because of that we are uh, the professional bodies like ishre ashre these are the very emerging professional bodies they give the funds to us for to developing the projects or the student develop the projects and hand over uh, to this the society as well as we are trying to solve some social problems through these the projects any message you would like to give to students who would like to make their career in engineering yeah see the message is very clear the life uh, when you come for the engineering when when you choose as engineering as a passion my message is very clear you should be the hard worker you decide you are the goal and to reach that the goal you take the continuous efforts so uh, in short i brief first you decide the goal then continuous effort and sincerity you maintain to reach your the goal so that message i try to pass on to my all engineering students thank you so much for your time and have a nice day thank you thank you